name is Sinclair, and I was a special guest today on Tuesday Talk. Today we talked about SOAP, a form of personal Bible study that I use. SOAP stands for S, Scripture, O, Observation, A, Application, and T, Prayer. Let's start with Scripture. I read a chapter, then ask, which scripture stuck out to me the most? I write it down. Feel free to be creative. Next, O, which is observation. I ask these questions. What do you think about the verse? What does God seem to be revealing through it? Do any words stand out? Who is the author addressing? What is the context? And who the passage is about? Next, A, application. Do any of these How do I apply this truth to my life? This might look different for everyone. Are there any areas in your life that do not align and need to change? Have you seen any growth? P, prayer. Write a prayer asking God to implement the scripture in your life. Pray for others that may be dealing with a similar issue and praise God for his blessings and opening your eyes to his truth. This can be personal or general prayer overall. SOAP is a great way of studying the word and applying this to your life. Tonight's lesson was simply to give you another tool to to apply personal Bible study to your life. This method of SOAP, scripture, observation, application, and prayer can be applied in any context in any scripture that you choose, whether you have a specific subject that you're going after or if it's just a scripture that you wanted to break down and get more knowledge about. Tonight's lesson, we decided to use one of Amanda's personal soaps as a, as a sort of example. We use Isaiah 54 and 10. That scripture says, though the mountains move and the hills shake, my love will not be removed from you, and my covenant of peace will not be shaken, says the Lord who is compassionate. The observation that she pulled from this is that this verse gave her peace in knowing that her mistakes don't account for the love that he has for her. She pulled out words like covenant, removed, shaken, compassionate. Um, The way she applied it is she looked at the complete scripture and she wrote one sentence to apply this so that she has something to look back at no matter what scripture in that particular passage she was looking at. And that application was the things of this world should not shake my thoughts on how God loves me. So anytime she has questions about the love of God or his covenant of peace over her, she can look back at this particular soap and have these scriptures to dissect for her life. And her prayer was a personal prayer where she asked God for forgiveness and for him to allow her and to give her strength to go through knowing that his peace and his love covers her. Again, this is just a tool that you can use to apply this to your study time so that the word of God can be broken down and easier for you to tackle. Thank you for joining us on Tuesday Talks, and we look forward to seeing you soon.